Welcome aboard. This is a quick overview of the user interface so you can see how it all works and then explore further at your own pace. Now we'll show you how to get your first searches running and how to check for stock availability and run brand restrictions checks. Now for a more in-depth guide to the power of Source Mogul, don't forget that we have a bunch of in-depth training videos and PDFs. And of course, hey, you can open a ticket in the bottom right hand side of your screen if you have any more questions. Let's get to it. The basics can be broken down into four stages. 1. Search. Set up your scan from one of hundreds of different retailers. 2. Results. First pass, look at the results. In this screen, we highly recommend adding everything you're even vaguely interested in to your wish list for stock and brand restriction analysis. 3. Analysis. We'll auto scan all the wish list products for stock availability at the retailer and you can also check brand restrictions. 4. Explore. Now you know what's in stock and what Amazon will let you trade, use our extensive filter tools and product data to decide what products you want to trade. Don't forget that if you don't want to handle any products yourself, you can use the services of an FBA prep center. Let's start by adding a retailer search. Just click Start Search by Retailer. For now, I'd suggest adding a supplier like Hobby Lobby or Walmart for your first search. Stack up as many searches as you want here. The huge suppliers take a few hours to run, but most of them are a matter of minutes. Don't forget, although we look at a retailer's entire product range, we'll only show you the products that could show a profit. Of course, that's going to be a fraction of their total product range. Okay, let's fast forward time a little. And hey presto, the searches are completed. So let's go and have a look. Use the drop down box here to select which search you want to explore. On the left, you can dial in whatever metrics you're interested in. Now, here's the real time saver. Use the results page as a first pass, a quick sift to find out items that you may possibly be interested in and add all of those products to your wish list. Now to your wish list. Source Mogul will run an automatic stock check on everything you add to your wish list. And you can see if it's in stock at the retailer. Plus, you can then see if Amazon will let you sell it by clicking the Check Brand Restrictions button. Any branded product that you can't sell through your Amazon account will be highlighted. And you can choose to delete them all from your wish list. On this page, as with the results page, you're able to adjust the filter settings to suit your needs and choose how the products are displayed. Detailed information is displayed by each product, starting with the recent history graph, then giving a breakdown of key data such as the potential profit, sales per month, ROI and sales rank. Through here you get further information on the Amazon seller competition, product details and spec and exactly how the Amazon fees are calculated. The wishlist icon at the top right of the page gives you the option to download your wishlist as a CSV at any time. Now you know the basics of how to navigate Source Mogul. Have a play around, run searches, and see for yourself just how useful our software can be. For more detailed user explanations, look for the video icon on any page. It's great to have you on board. Welcome to the team.